Hey everybody, this is Gregory from DAP University, and today I wanted to introduce you to a new piece of decentralized technology called Essentia. Essentia is a masternoded multi-chain set of protocols connecting centralized and decentralized resources to create new powerful interactions and experiences. It's a really cool piece of tech that's solving the problem of interoperability. You see, there's all these disparate resources out there in the blockchain ecosystem, and Essentia connects all of them in one place. So be sure to subscribe to this channel for more videos like this one, where I introduce you to new cutting-edge decentralized applications as they come out in the booming blockchain space. So in order to use Essentia, you want to visit Essentia.one, and the first step is to click on Try Essentia. This will redirect you to you know, app.essentia.one. This is where the actual application will live. So Essentia is very new, and I'm going to go over the features that are currently available in the 1.0 version of Essentia, um, which is the first release before their public sale of their Essentia token, which is going to be coming up on June 25th. So Essentia manages identity with the concept of an essence. And this is the manifestation of digital life. You know, this is where a person's data is stored. And it's decentralized. You, as the user, own it. You can act with other services, you know, centralized or decentralized. And it's going to allow you to retain ownership of your data, all of your data, in this process. There are a few different ways that you can manage your essence. You can sign up and create a new one, which I'll show you momentarily. But first, I'll show you the different ways to log in. You can log in with a JSON keystore file, or you can use a seed, or a mnemonic, or you can use a hardware wallet like Trezor or Ledger. And you can use one of these hardware wallets to manage your essence. This will allow you to manage files, dApp content, and settings all from this hardware wallet. Since Essentia is modular, you can just choose the modules that you need for certain occasions. And I actually spoke with the team at Essentia, and they have a lot of really cool stuff on their roadmap. For example, it's gonna be possible to use a hardware wallet to trade with a decentralized exchange soon. And they're planning to release iOS, Android, and browser applications. And all this seeks to bring seamless integration so that users don't have to keep track of passwords or seed phrases across multiple dApps and services. Now I'll show you how to create a new account. We'll go here and click this Get Started button and we'll be prompted to create a new password. Once we do that, we'll get a confirmation that you know our essence is being generated. Now it's important to remember, with your essence, you're going to own all of your own data. And the Essentia platform can't even see the data that you provide. Now once your essence has been generated, you'll have access to a backup. There are a few different backup methods here. You can show a mnemonic phrase. You have access to a seed which you can use to back up your account. And you also have the ability to save a, a JSON keystore file. Now that the essence is generated, we can take a look at the DAP store and I can show you a few things here. You'll see a list of you know, DAPs that are you know, about to be integrated here. And we can see a list of DAPs that are already integrated into Essentia, like Swarm. And these are dApps that you can already access here on the sidebar. And a really cool feature is Essentia is you know, taking input from you know, users about what dApps they want to integrate into the platform. So you can find dApps that you already know about and vote for them to be included in Essentia. You can also search for these and you know, search by category. So let's take a tour of some of the dApps and modules that are integrated with Essentia. First, we'll go to the wallet. This is where you can see all the tokens that you have in your wallet. And you can see a list of tokens that Essentia already supports. And you'll also notice that uh, the Essentia token will be supported as soon as the crowd sale is complete. We can go over the features of this wallet. We'll select you know, the Ethereum token first. If you scroll down, you can see your Ethereum address here. You can you know, copy this uh, to send to someone else, or you can you know, use a QR code is the send and receive feature. You can click send and type the address of the recipient here. And you can select the amount, the gas limit, 
and any optional data that you would like to send. And you can you know, generate this transaction. You can also receive funds. You can select the amount that you would like to receive and a description. And you can use this QR code to send this to your sender. There are also some other handy tools in the bottom of this wallet. You can track the price of each coin in your wallet. Right now we have you know, Ethereum selected and you can you know, compare the price of Ether to the Bitcoin price as well as the fiat price. You can also see you know, the asset distribution. You know, once you have tokens loaded in your wallet, you can see you know, what percentage you have for Ethereum, for Bitcoin, Litecoin, etc. And you can also see the transaction history once you have created some transactions. And this is all a very nice way of tracking the assets that are a part of your essence. And this feature is available for you know, every token that's supported by your essence. The next module is going to be the file storage module. So Essentia allows you to upload files in a decentralized and secure way with three different pieces of technology. You can use IPFS, Swarm, and Storage. And you can upload files by you know, selecting a piece of technology and select Upload. And what's really cool about Essentia is whenever you're uploading these files, if one of these methods fails, it will you know, default into a backup of one of these other methods. So this means that whenever you're uploading files, your uploads are secure as well as the storage itself. And this upload method is available for you know, any of these pieces of technology that you choose, like Swarm or Storage. Now the next module I want to explore is the e-login module. And this is basically a single login that allows you to authenticate with all of these different blockchain protocols. So with Essentia, you'll be able to log into all your decentralized applications securely with just a few clicks. And basically with a simple message verification, you can log into a bunch of different services without having to remember you know, a password. So we can see a list of the platforms that are currently supported. We've got Aragon, IOTA, Omise Go, Status, Neo, and Ethereum. And essentially you can you know, click on one, I'll choose Ethereum, and send a login request. And once the login request is uh, verified, then you're essentially logged into their platform with your essence. So Essentia is really great for traders because there are decentralized exchanges integrated into Essentia already. For example, this next module is uh, Fork Delta, which I'll demo some of the features of here. So Fork Delta has been integrated into Essentia. You can see this you know, custom UI that has been created here, which looks really nice. You can select you know, any of the tokens that are supported on uh, Fork Delta. And you can see your address here. You can deposit or withdraw the token balance. You can also create a new order that will be set in the order book for the exchange. You can also see the you know, volume for each token on the exchange right here. And you can also see you know, the order book for that particular token on the exchange. You can also see you know, the trade history. And you can also see your own personal transaction history whenever you make some. You can see this last module here is IDEX, which has you know, recently been integrated into Essentia. And you can see you know, some of the similar features uh, to Fork Delta. And in addition to these other exchanges, you can use FlipMe. And FlipMe allows you to convert tokens you know, instantly on demand based on a certain price. You, know, you don't have to set a limit order like you would on an exchange. You can simply select the token that you'd like to you know, convert. You say, I have Bitcoin and I want to convert it to Ethereum. And we can see there's lots of currencies, you know, coins, tokens supported here. The next module to cover is Aragon. And with Aragon, you, know, you can create organizations and there are a few ways you can do this. You can create a new organization or you can join an existing organization. And all you need to do is paste the address for the uh, Aragon organization and click join. The next module is the Omise Go module, which is currently running on a test net. And in order to get started, you can simply enter your private key and your public key and click save. And the next integration is status. So status has integrated a decentralized chat protocol with Whisper, which is very cool because it allows you to send messages in a decentralized way. So this is an Ethereum-based technology, and you know we can add a new contact here. All you would need is the you know, contact's public key, and you can give them a name, and you would add them as a contact. 
And whenever you do that, you can start sending messages back and forth in a decentralized way over Ethereum with this other person. And the last module that I want to show you today is the Akasha platform. So Akasha has been natively integrated into Essentia. And, you know, this defaults to the Essentia Akasha page. And, you know, you can see all of the articles listed here. And in addition to, you know, the Essentia page, you can select go to and enter the address of anyone who is creating content on Akasha. So that's it. That's an overview of how you can use Essentia. And again, you can find this by visiting app.essentia.one to get started. And again, this is, you know, version 1.0 of Essentia. It's pretty new. So if you need help, you can click the support form tab down here. You can also get support from the community with some community links, which I'll provide down in the description below, like Telegram, where you can get more information about how to use Essentia, as well as more information about how to participate in their public sale, which I'll also include a link to down in the description below. So again, check out app.essentia.one and be sure to subscribe to the channel for more videos like this, where I'm showing you cutting edge decentralized technology as soon as it comes out. And until then, Thanks for watching DAP University.